So, um, I used to look at Carbonation, or uh, Nature Boy, right? I mostly looked at his Instagram page because he had this, these episodes called Real N-I-G-G-A Moments, or S-H-I-T, I forgot. But anyway, I looked at it and it was just really entertaining to me. I never thought of him to be a leader or a teacher. Um, half of the stuff that he said was funny, and, and but it, what made it so funny is that he really believed in the lies that he would say. When he would get on live with people, you know, he'd be cursing people out, and it, it was just funny to me. It was, it was humorous until, you know, I started to see like cult like, you know, things going on, you know. You know, I, I used to be part of a cult, you know, called the Nuwabians or no, United Nuwabian Nation or I don't know what they, they call themselves Sabians now, you understand? So I know, uh, I could sense a cult when I, I, I see it, right? Or I could see the signs of a cult when I, when I see one. So, you know, I see that, you know, further down the line, it, it, it didn't become humorous to me anymore. Now it, it appears that this guy is a manipulator and that he he actually you know he's bringing in these women weak-minded women um but these women have sincere intentions of going down to mexico wherever they at wherever they you know are located because they move from place to place to place to place to place so i don't know where they where they at right now they may be in san, san juan i don't know so he gets these women, these women come, come, um, go down to wherever he's at and they're sincere. They are all about nature and, 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 and loving each other, brothers and sisters and stuff like that. But once they get down there, they realize that they're caught in, caught in a cult and that these women have to have sex with, with Nature Boy. And that not just, you know, you have to have sex with Nature Boy if you're a female, but you have to have sex like freaky whatever he wants you know what i'm saying like whether it's a twosome threesome foursome i uh, recently listened to um uh eliana and her testimony and how she was saying that you know for two weeks straight they stayed in this 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 room and all of the females including some of the the uh girlfriends of the men men you know one of them being pregnant were, were in that room and all of them had to have sex. Everybody had to have their clothes off and they, they, they were doing this amongst the children. So it's like, I'm seeing things slowly but surely manifest and I'm saying to myself, wow, Dr. Malakazi York and Nature Boy are one and the same. They're one and the same. I sat there and saw Ileana cry her heart out because of the fact that she had to do things that went against her, 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 her morals and principles. Like Nature Boy actually has a picture, or, or I've seen the picture, I haven't seen the recording, you know, of I Ileana giving him a blowjob. And she, he put that on online for the world to see. You understand? And, and it's like, I'm listening to her, her testimony, I'm looking at other people that left combination, their testimony, and then I'm, I'm thinking and I'm comparing the two. What changed me, what made me step away from the United Nuwabian Nation is the, 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 uh, the victims, such as Nicole Lopez, I heard her testimony. And when I heard her testimony as well as others, because as of recently, they've been you know, telling their experience and what they've been through as far as dealing with Dr. Malakazi York. But prior to that, the only person that was saying anything about what was going on as far as child molestation charges were the Nuwabians and Dr. York, and they were screaming out how innocent he is and da-da-da-da-da. But when you hear the testimony of the victims, it was the same way that the testimonies um, that, uh, such as Ilana, Ileana and the others that left coronation, it was, it was 
they they were the same way crying being hurt feel um being abused i don't know if dr malakazi or put his hands on any of one of those women or, little, or, or girls or, or boys but i I, I know based on the testimony of and the, far as dealing with ex-members of Carbonation, they said that they, they got their ass beat. And this is crazy. And people keep on telling me to stop doing Dr. Malachi's York videos. People keep on telling me, well, you move on. You know, you've been through it. You need to just move on. No, I, I moved on. But now I need to forewarn people. Now I need to forewarn people. And I told you all that this was going to happen. I told you that after Dr. Malakaz York, there's going once he's gone for good, like he dies, there's going to be someone that replace him. Period. We're going to have cults until we die. There's always going to be some Looney Tune that's going to be narcissistic, demonic, and all about sexuality and performing all types of freaky shit. That's gonna walk this planet and that's gonna have followers and those followers or members to, to that specific cult is truly gonna believe that this one man is gonna save the world in the case of Nature Boy and in the case of Dr. Malakazi York. And when Ileana you know, made her you know, had a testimony, she was talking about how you all don't understand, and if you were all in the same situation, then maybe you would make the same decisions. And I totally get her because I was in a cult. So I understand how one teacher, you know, how that teacher, like from a, from a distance, Dr. Malakazi York was, was controlling me, from a distance. But Eliana, in Eliana's case, and the, the members of Carbonation's case, they were right there. They were right there with him. So there's no telling how much mind manipulation that he was performing on them. You know, she said that they would have these these ongoing meetings that would last for hours upon hours upon hours. And I remember, but that wasn't what Dr. York, you know, the satellite store. So, you know, I, I was one of part of part of one of the satellite stores, meaning, you know, you had the major headquarters and Edenton. And then you had other stores that were around, um, you know, uh, America. They claim that, you know, what United Nawabian Nation bookstore. I don't know what they call them now, All Eyes Up on Egypt bookstore. Um, when I was, you know, part of the bookstore, we call it the Holy Tabernacle, uh, or rather short HTM. So they claim that, that, that it's stores around the world. I, I hardly believe that. I think they probably have one in Barbados, one in London, and that's about it. <laughs> anyway, um, and possibly one in Jamaica. Anyway, um, you know, we would have these meetings, and and in the meetings they would be cursing us out. You know what I'm saying? Um, like we had to turn in money, and if we didn't meet our quota at the end of the week, we was getting cursed out. Now it was better that we were getting cursed out because prior to that, when the Nuwabians were the Ansar Allah community, and they they were in Bushwick, Brooklyn, if you didn't <laughs> have your turn in. Turning, meaning you, you didn't give money each week, you were getting your ass kicked, literally. You know what I'm saying? I know a good good brother, man, named Hood, you know, um, never forget it. You know, he, he sat down with me and, you know, he was like, yo, they broke my nose. They beat my ass and they broke my nose in the process of um, disciplining me because I didn't have my turning at the end of the week. These coats are real, man. These coats are real. And Elagio or Nature Boy or Baba Ja or whatever, what the hell the hell he calls himself? You see, you see the similars, Sim similarities? Don't you see that? Dr. York, he 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 got a thousand and one names too. Uh, Bob Hyde, Nab Bab Yanun, Dr. Malakazi York, Amanubi Rock Batar, Afrote Tun Ray. The list goes on. They're one and the same. Yeah, they may look different. One may be shorter than the other, one may be older than the other. But they still have the same state of mind. And it's crazy how all cult leaders think the same. 
they all have this 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 whole narcissistic attitude where they have to they have to control everything and they're 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 the, they're the top like they're they're the, the savior they're here to come and save us and then and and then they they have that sex that sex that high sex drive you know what i'm saying like they 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 always want to have sex and it's always freaky and nasty and pervert perverted it's crazy like dr york was having sex with little boys and girls and then the wabians would say this is this is this is how they trick you they'll say how did he have sex with those with little boys and girls where these 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 got the, the, these same girls boys and girls that you're talking about are adults yes duh they're adults now we they weren't talking about them being adults now they were talking about them when they were children period and nature boy has said that he wanted to do things with little kids and 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 um Eliana said that he, she woke up one one night and you know she got woke up because they she he was having sex with Eliana um what, I don't know the other broad name some some other broad name some other broad the skinny broad y'all know carbonation more than I know her you know what I'm saying I don't know the names they ain't that important to me you know what I mean but anyway she was he was having sex with you know I guess his other wife or whatever have you Eliana Eliana's baby. She was holding Indiana's baby while they were having sex. That's some perverted shit. And then when she went to go grab Indiana, Nature Boy was like, "Why are you doing that?" Like it's it's just, yo man, this. I'm gonna keep on doing these videos, and I don't care. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn who don't like them. We got enough on our plate. That's facts. That's big facts. We got enough on our plate as far as being African American. And then now this COVID-19 happens. And people have lost their job. And people, people are waiting for this stimulus check that they supposed to have gave the American citizens in July. And now they just passed it. But it's no telling when we're gonna get it. And you have men out here manipulating other people. Some of these women have left their homes and left their kids in order to, 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 to go down there and, de and, and, and deal with Nature Boy. He's broken up homes. Same thing Dr. Malakazi York did. Same thing, no different. They're one and the same. And it's just that plain and simple. You can't, you cannot separate them because they have the same type of mentality. And it, Nature Boy knows of, of, of Dr. Malakazi York. He's mentioned him quite a few times. And I think that he I think that he took a few pointers from Dr. York. Not to say that Dr. York like physically talked to him. I'm talking about like he just an, uh, 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 analyzed and went through, you know, his movements and 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 just studied him. Dr. York, that is. Nature Boy studying him. So we definitely need to get them out of, out of our community, man, because they're no good, they're toxic. You understand, like, I, I look at it like this, man, you, 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 you going around and you having sex with multiple women, and then after that, they leave, and you bring more women in, and you have sex with them, and they leave, and you bring more women in, and you have sex with them, and in the process of you having sex with them, you're having multiple children, so there's no telling how many children that you have, nature boy, just like Dr. York. It was, they said on paper, they really didn't, they don't know factually, but on paper, Dr. York has, has 100, I think 125 kids on paper. 125. And let me tell you something. I went to, um, I forgot what his son's name, but I went to his Facebook page, The Son, not Prince York. Um, one of them have a, a, a picture, a, they took a family reunion picture. And when I tell you, that shit looked like damn near 100 and they were like, that's not even all of us. Man, I, I just, you know, this is the thing, man. 
I have the potential of, you know, being a cult leader. You know, I could be manip manip manipulative. I can be deceitful. I can use my intelligence to, 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 to get what I want from women, but I can never see me, myself doing that, ever. Because it's a thing that wins me over all the time. And that thing is, I never want to see a woman cry. I never want to see a woman in pain, ever, ever. I don't like to see a woman cry. I would never hit a woman. Overall, I don't want to see my people go through what, they, what, they, what they're going through and more. I just don't, it gets to a point where you have to say, say to yourself, yo, do you really have a heart? Do you really care about people? And the reality of it is, is that neither Nature Boy or Dr. Melikaze Dr. Mel Dr. Mel York cares about people. You know who they care about? Themselves. This is the reason why I have to continue doing these videos. To make sure that my daughters, my sons, your daughters, your sons, your mother, your aunts, your uncles, and the likes, just your family and friends, never, ever, 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 ever fuck with either one of them. Whether it's Nature Boy or Dr. Melakazi York. You know, I do these tours, right? To lighten it up a little bit. I do these tours around Charlotte and I tell people about Charlotte and I tell people about Atlanta. And some people have, have I've won them over. Some people have actually moved here based on my videos to Charlotte. And some people based on my videos about Atlanta have actually said, hey, you know what? I was thinking about moving here like next year, but you read it down to me and after looking at your videos about Atlanta, mm, nah, that's okay. That's the same thing I want to do as far as dealing with Dr. Malakazi York and Nature Boy. I want, I want testimonies. I want people to say, yo man, you know what? I was, I was thinking about joining Carbonation TV, uh, Carbonation. Yo man, I went, I went to uh, 125th and seen the brother out there selling books. You know, and I was about to become a member of the Nuwabian Nation until I saw Confessions of an Ex-Nuwabian, parts one through 25, and the other videos that you've done outside of Confessions of Ex-Nuwabian about the cult as well as Dr. Melakazi York. That's what I wanna hear. I don't wanna hear any more testimonies of he used and abused me and I've seen women crying and he had sex and he took advantage of me and now I had his child and he don't want to take care of it and blah 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 blah. I don't want that anymore. I don't want the pain and suffering anymore. Listen, I went through it. Ileana went through it. All of the ex-carbonation -carb mem uh, ex carbonations members went through it. Ex Nuwabians, other ex Nuwabians went through it, so you all won't have to go through it. It's just that plain and simple. Hey, listen, I definitely want you to share this video. This has to go around. This has to, it has to, I, I mean, I, 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 was, I would go as far as to say it has to go viral because this is important. This is bigger than me. This ain't about likes and views and all the rest of that sh shit when dealing with these type of videos. Like I'm not being selfish or you know, or trying to trying to blow up, you know, and say, oh yeah, make this viral so I can be a star. No, I want this to be viral so everybody can hear it and see it and know to stay away from the likes of Nature Boy, Dr. Mel and Dr. Melakazi York. If I had other cult leaders, if I knew of other ones, I would have mentioned them. Period. If you know any other cult members or, or, or street scholars, you know, I call them street scholar pimps. You know, they got a certain amount of education and they spit and they regurgitating that knowledge out. And next thing you know, oh, you hook, line, and sinker. So you sending them money. And then you find out that person scammed you. So if you know of anybody that I, that I failed to mention, please put it in the comment section. If you think Dr. Umar Johnson is a scammer, hey, I didn't say it, put it in the comment section. If you think Brother Polite is a scammer, I didn't say it, put it in the comment section. If you think Sarnetta is a scammer, I didn't say it, but put it in the comment section. 
people got to get their 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 card pulled. I would I would want that to happen to me if I was out there scamming people. Me, if I was out there scamming people, if I was out there uh, abusing women, having multiple sex partners, and just and having babies and, and not taking care of them, I would want to get called out. It's just that plain and simple. It's fair uh, all, all across this board, period. Everybody got to get called out for their fuckery. It's just that plain and simple. Um, other than that, as usual, I want you to like, comment, subscribe, and want, you know, for the second time, share this video.